I'm always very nervous before we do a, a capture. I mean, there's so many things that can go wrong you know, on, a, on a given capture day. And I always say to myself, if you stop getting nervous, then I actually need to stop what I'm doing. But white rhinos generally are quite placid. I quite enjoy working with them. Black rhinos is just, it's just a different beast. It's a, it's a, it's a rocket. It's, so you never know what to expect. I mean, they are amazing beasts in themselves, you know, just the way they are, but they're full of attitude and, and we need to basically expect the unexpected. The black rhinos, as I say, are a lot more feisty than the white rhinos, so we need to be a little bit more careful about how we walk them and the drugs we give them. So we manage them probably a bit better in terms of the reversal drugs. The closer they are to the box, the better, because sometimes they can run away with you, which is a bit disconcerting when you when you hanging on the end of a rope and a rhino is charging through the bush, it's, uh, yeah, it's not great. You end up with lots of thorns everywhere. Seven critically endangered black rhino were recently translocated from South Africa to Zanav National Park in Mozambique. With so few of these remarkable animals left on the planet, extreme caution was taken to safely catch, transport and release them into temporary holding facilities before their long journey to their new home that will offer them space and safety to thrive. There are no black rhinos in Zanav. They've been extinct in that park for I would think at least 50 years, if not longer. So it's going to be an amazing, actually an amazing project, full stop, taking the species back to, back to Zanav.